um i know look my mom is making noise outside so just pardon me if you keep hearing us i can't tell my mom to shut up because you know how african moms can be so yeah hey everyone this is benjamin here from the african geek and you are welcome to this fantastic tutorial inside of canva today what we are going to do is what you see on my screen and please 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 again this tutorial is only for people who have six packs so maybe from four packs to six packs if you're a lady i know you don't have six packs so please you can search for other <laughs> designs i have on my um, channel but you know if this is something you want to be able to create with me it's very simple so um i'll just say stay tuned and i would be right back after the intro all right so you can see when i scroll up this is the design we are trying to remake and it's a very simple design we can finish in five minutes and i think five minutes is even too much four minutes so this is going to be a very short tutorial okay so the first thing we are going to do is to add our image so i have this is the image i used and um, you can see when some ladies see this they'll be like Ooh, i'm dying <laughs> yeah so we come to edit image and in edit image we are going to remove the background of this image and while we wait for it i want to use this opportunity to tell you about canva pro canva pro is very 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 and while we wait for this i just want you to say that if you are interested in upgrading to canva pro which i think you should there's a special link i have in the description box below that can help you get canva pro okay at a very cool price and also if you are someone who maybe you're not ready to purchase canva pro but you want to try to see the possibilities of canva pro the same link can help you to get a 30-day free trial you know for canva pro so i would highly recommend you at least try it if you are not ready to buy canva pro and yes look i'm a canva pro user and i've seen the difference between the free version and canva pro you understand and if you are really serious about getting clients upgrading your canva skills canva pro is the best option for you so if you are interested just check the link like i mentioned earlier and yeah let's dive straight into the design okay so you can see our image is fully done we'll crop it this way and we would increase the size okay then we position it somewhere here we can increase the size more so you can see here what i did was i just um we'll just leave it this way i think there's no um, problem or increase it and crop the image okay so when you do that you can just leave it this way and with the background you can use any background color of your choice so if you want to use a purple which i don't think is the best because black usually shows some sort of energy you know so we'll just use black for now and we're also trying to make sure our design is saved so to ensure it's saved you always have to be looking here once it says all design saved then means you are good to go so you can see canva is doing this thing to save our design so once uh, since we are waiting what we are going to do is there's this special shadow i used okay so if i copy and paste it here you wouldn't see it until the design comes on okay so i'll position the shadow here and with the shadow you can find it on clip arts or you can come to element and search for gradient okay to white okay so when you search for gradient to white you know there are so many options over here you can come to graphics especially and um, you can look through you can you can actually look through or you can take the time go to cliparts.com and search for gradient okay black gradient shadow sort of you would also find it or the other option i have for you is i have a link in the description box that will take you to a google drive which i have to um, update because there are so many things i need to put in and um, you would find it there but i've also been thinking and um, i would love to hear your thought about this in the comment section i've also been thinking to create maybe a special page on my website for just element so that with every tutorial the elements will be there you can just go there click on download and you just have it yourself so let me know if this is something you'd like um, us to have okay okay so now that we have the design here click on your okay on your image the subject image come to edit image and in edit image you see adjust click on see all so if you are good at this you can 
you know adjust all of these things to get a black and white or if you want a very easy way come to filters click on see or scroll down you see streets so when you click on it you see how this is looking okay so come back to adjust and we are going to adjust things a little bit so with the brightness i can reduce it a little bit more and i click on see or i can increase the blurriness also a little bit and um, the clarity how sharp you want it to look okay i'll just increase it by four which is okay so this is what we have and yeah i think it's it's looking very nice so the next thing we're going to do is to add some text so you can come to text okay or you can press t on your keyboard but sometimes most of you have your text you know glitching <laughs> okay so then you can just put everything anything you want to have so i can just say six packs okay and um i would increase the size which you also have to do and would also duplicate this bring it here select this one also duplicate it bring it to the bottom over here okay then maybe one more to the top bring it here then hold shift and select all of these okay yeah so we have all of it selected come to color and choose any color at all you can choose the yellow like i did you can choose any color at all of your choice but i'll just stick to yellow increase the size and maybe adjust it just a little bit but how many times i did it for one two three four okay so uh maybe we should just stick to four okay so one two three four select everything here so one oh okay so one two what am i doing okay yeah then we increase the size okay then right click and send it to the back so you can see this is what we have over here right now it's looking very interesting so i'll bring my shadow down a little bit so that it covers everything and i want the contrast to be um obvious so i duplicate no not this one i duplicate the shadow okay so you can see and i can duplicate it more so that we can have something like this and this is the main thing about this design the remaining thing is you adding your shape and um i'll just show you what to do okay so i'll just select all of these and i'll come to paste it over here okay so what we are going to do is you can add your main text okay which i have this fag i don't know what it means and i just selected one of the characters i came to colors and i changed it okay so that it looks um uniform then um i had this text over here which i'll just change the color to the same thing then i came to effect okay and i clicked on hollow and you can adjust it on how you want it to look but you can also add any other thing else you want to have on your design but you can see here i added um a text no you can see over here i added the shape behind okay so all you can just do is to press r on your keyboard because you realize it wasn't selecting so press r on your keyboard and um, if your r is glitching you can just come to element and element let me close this up you can come to line and shape select this and adjust it okay and i'll just have it here then we would click out okay and resize so once you resize this is how it's going to look but you can change the color to any color at all you want but i think i'll just leave it like this and um, yeah you can see this is a very simple design we created in canva one tutorial i would want to recommend to you is this one you see on my screen right now it also has a lot of interesting tips and tricks i believe can also help you so much so yes this is very easy this is very simple i would highly recommend you to check out canva pro okay use the link also if you are interested in more canva related videos um you can subscribe you can hit on the bell icon you can share this video to other people okay share the video this is the best thing you can do